So apart from getting an absolutely insane amount of diamonds from what I'm assuming was Etho's shopping spree recently, I was surprised to see a whole other surprise waiting for me at my base. Wait, 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 I've only just logged on and I thought I'd fly over to Cleo, so I looked over. I was seeing what Cleo was doing with the tr with the railway thing. And look! Wait, look, I've got... I, 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 I was I expecting it yet. Wait, what? This is... It's been built. It's literally been built. Like, the two days after talking to Pearl. I thought I was waiting a week or two. Wait, this is sick. This is... Wait, is it all down here? Wait, Ethan's on right now. Is he building it right now? Like, what's going on? I got, well, I gotta thank him. I gotta thank him. This is what... Ah! Oh, sorry. I thought I was gonna die then. Oh, wait. Oh, thanks for doing the mailbox. Yeah, I've got a mailbox. I sorry, I'm, I'm kind of maybe more excited than I should be. Truly really wasn't expecting it for at least a little while. So this is this is cool. This is very cool. What are these? My stamp collection. Wait, what's the book for? What's the book for? I'm confused. What's the book for? <laughs> Just free books. Maybe it's to do with the, the how I order stamps or something. That's cool though. Okay, okay, let's get this just like, you know, straight up just right here. <laughs> for now, I'll have to try and build a platform maybe a little bit today. If I have time for today's video. Um, start building this platform out so that I can actually get rid of the scaffold. But look! <gasps> wait, is this my... Wait, are these stamps? Oh no, wait, this is... Property of Hermit Post Co. Wait a second, wait a second. What does it say in it? What does it say? False online, wait! Hey! Welcome to the Mail Network where opportunities for big business found! Yes! Yes, Etho! Etho knows about big business. Wait, I'm not even wearing my top hat. Okay, I'll, I'll wear it in a minute. I'll wear it in a minute. But talk to Postmaster Pearl for your tutorial and for free stamps. Ah! Oh! I'm, I'm ex okay, this is cool. This is cool. Thank you, guys! <laughs> right, good luck, everybody, because cause now I've got access to this. Uh, gonna be sending things everywhere. Just at random, because I can. <laughs> Uh, I mean, it'll be expensive probably, but uh, you know, at least for a while I'll be, you know, having some fun with it. Thank you guys! <laughs> Aha! <laughs> I have access to the postal system. My plan for big business is, uh, is, is, is happening. It's happening. It's happening, guys. We need to sell rivers via post. Postal rivers. <laughs> Do you think it'll catch on? <laughs> Maybe. You never know though, but uh, all I can say is this thing is going to be a lot of fun. I definitely need some ideas for things to send people and stuff and fun fun shenanigans that can be had. So let me know uh, below. Anyway, platform. I want to get at least half or maybe less of this area filled in today. But we'll get on with that a little bit later on. I've got other things to do first, which is meeting up with some various hermits. One of those being chatting with Ren about his custom river order, as we spoke about last episode. So hopefully you'll see one of those pop up in the next week or so, and it's going to be such a fun little custom design with his sulfur idea, so I'm very, very excited about it. And hopefully he is too. But not only did I meet up with Ren for that thing, but Hypno also joined us, and they took me to see the gold farm that they built previously. And well, uh, I'm in desperate need of gravel pretty soon, so uh, yeah. I mean, my uh, concrete permit in here, which I can't seem to get to, is uh, gonna need it. Yeah, gonna need it badly. Hi. Hello. Hey. You guys swooping in from nowhere? We Terrifying. We swooped in Fresh from the out nether. Of the nether. Oh, oh, interesting. Yeah, we're here for a chat about the thing that we spoke about the other day. You know the thing? Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The thing, the thing. The thing in the thing. The big thing in the nether. S yeah, still interested? Maybe. There's a lot of <laughs> gravel apparently that you need. Oh, that see that? Yeah, yeah, maybe, maybe I am. Maybe I am. Half yeah. of your concrete shop, we can provide the resources for half of the concrete shop. That if would be amazing. You come and help us make the place look better. Shall, shall we yeah, show you? Well, yeah, show me because I actually don't know where it is. <laughs> okay, come like this way. Old. Into the Nether. Into the Nether oh, again. Oh, I missed. Hypno and I, we are working on a gold farm that is going to be a bartering farm so that we can share resources for our shops. That's the thing. That is it. I can see it already. Oh my goodness, that thing is crazy. Yeah, it's pretty big. Wow. It's pretty cool big. though. This makes the gold. We're going to be working on part two, uh, which is going to be the bartering system. Probably going okay. to put it above, right? Hypno, I'm thinking like where, but just below the AFK platform, maybe something like this. So false, like if you have any ideas to make this look better, I mean, it, look, it looks great. cool already, but yeah, definitely we can do some fun things with this, perhaps. 
I mean, it is big though. Right, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's quite enormous. big. Yeah, but I'm guessing I mean, we, you want we can to help you cover with the resources, it, right? A little bit. Help you you want the... to cover it, make it look cool, and have the barring thing inside somewhere. Exactly. Yeah. yeah, yeah. All the gold is up here in this chest, and this is what we're gonna be bartering with. Cool. Yeah. Sounds yeah, good, guys. Yeah, yeah. Sounds good. All right. Awesome. That's a great deal. We can help you get the resources and stuff that you need also for the build once you figure out what it's going to be because it's yeah. pretty large. I have no idea. Yeah, so I'm absolutely. Gonna, I'm going to think on it and uh, brainstorm some ideas. So if you've got any ideas, I'll, I'll I'll take them. Okay. I mean, the first thing I think about when I see this thing is a massive tank. But maybe that's just my 10-year-old brain <laughs> kicking like, in. Like the dri driving kind? Yeah, like a vehicle, right? Like the bottom bits could be the tracks interesting interesting and then the top is like a oh. some sort of steampunk weird like um capacitor or something like a battery or something i, don't I know, think i'm leaving like this to, I, I was to thinking rent. of something more boring like a building or something like a skyscraper but right the tank it, sounds it, pretty cool say, it's, it's very tall for for ren's idea but uh but i uh, but it's kind of cool yeah we'll yeah. see we'll see well that's all i've got <laughs> <laughs> in the idea department well, this is what yeah. a tank it's good sweet so uh, I guess the question is, have I bitten off a little bit more than I can chew here with the build? Possibly. I mean, granted, I probably don't need to cover this all, but I do kind of want to cover it all and make it just look like something completely other than this gold farm. It has been updated since. I believe that was Ren. There is actually a piglin up there, which I don't think is probably the plan. Pretty sure that's like not... Or maybe it is. Wait, maybe it is. Maybe that's the trade part. Sorry, I didn't mean to disturb you guys. I'm trying to get away from these scary gas sounds I hear when I land down here. But uh, there it is in all its glory. But if you thought that was all of Hypno you're going to see today, then you are wrong. Because he popped over to my base while he was streaming to check out yet another, yes, another buggy item thing that is happening on the server. And I guess he needed my expert eye, my expert eye, to see uh, to see what it was. And so we went on a bit of a journey to find Azuma. So enjoy. I see you, Hypno. Hello, false. Hello. I saw a name. I was like, who is that? Like, no one's usually around here. <laughs> yeah, where, where are you? I'm on the ground. Oh, you are. Right. I have a question for you. Mm -hmm. If you can come yeah. above ground. I'm here. I mean, I mean, you can come in. Okay. I'm, I'm, can I come in? Yeah. Okay. All right. I'm inside. So I just noticed something weird, and I don't know if this is my own game client that's doing it. Am I holding this pickaxe strangely, or does it look like a normal pickaxe to you? Um, <laughs> that's not a real pickaxe, Hypno. You've been scammed, I what think. You... No, it's a real one. So that that's what a diamond one looks like. This what? is another right one. Are you, uh, are you sure you're not an armor stand? Here. That's a real pickaxe. You can mine with it. Wait, why am I so holding it is... weird? Yeah, right? What are you, what? I was just holding it. I went to F5 and I was like, wait a second. What's wrong with that? And then I picked the diamond one. No, it's real. There's nothing fake about it. I'm have not you got to, like, any other netherite tools? Uh, yeah, I have a netherite shovel here. The, that one looks weird, too. Oh, so it's all netherite tools? Because I don't have any netherite, so I... This guy is playing hide-and-seek on the server. Where is he? Didn't answer because he was relaxing. Stop relaxing, Azuma. Where are you? You can't relax in no Minecraft. No relaxing allowed. So you got to get a permit for that. Only per <laughs> you only have to have a permit relaxing. for relaxing. Where is he? I still, can't, I still can't see his name. He's not even here. He says he's here. He's lying. You need a permit for that as well. <laughs> I found name tag. Can't lie without permit. Azuma. Where is he? Azuma. I'm going to check downstairs at his base. There's a downstairs? I don't... He's shifting somewhere. I feel like he's hiding. on. Oh. Maybe? I'm not hiding. I'm just... I'm a mess of block and inventory clutter. Azuma, Dude, have you what? pressed F5 and look at your hand? Look, compared to, compared to, compared to me. Uh, okay, I know why it's... Uh, well, yeah, I know why it's doing that. You've got weird pickaxes. Yep. You guys are weird. <laughs> the axe I... and the shovel also does that too. <laughs> I pushed an update to the resource pack to try and add um, like custom textures for the netherite tools. And long story short, it was just a resource pack bug where it just didn't reset properly when Azuma was removing a custom item that didn't quite work. Very, very odd indeed. But hey, at least Detective False and Hypno were on the case, right? Yeah, well, the, the server wouldn't have survived otherwise. <laughs> but anyway, whilst we were hanging out with Azuma, I may have got a little bit carried away with uh, the allies he had over there. 
And well, as Zuma told me how to tame one, and uh, what a journey that was. Just just a few years too late. <laughs> so I'm giving it a. Oh, you got one. Amethyst. Okay. Amethyst shard. Whoa. Then it's gonna. Right. So that guy who's fresh, you need to go give him a dirt block. I'm gonna give him a moss block. E. Okay, but you need more moss blocks. I've now got. I've got a few. Yeah. Yeah. Throw it on the ground, and it will come to you and throw like uh, pick it up uh, and throw it at you. Let me get out. Quick. And that is the way in which you kind of like fuck with them. Okay, is there it. a delay on how often you can breed them? Is it still five minutes or can you just do it over and over? I've lost them. Oh, whoa, they're you quick. Well? <laughs> Go get it. Fetch. It is. We, I, this is actually better than dogs in Minecraft, right? <laughs> they actually play fetch with yeah, you. They're, they're, they're pretty good. They're pretty good once you get the hang oh, of I've lost him. There he is. This is actually the wildest thing. I don't know how I've not now done this. Being a pain. There you go. Thank you, X. I now have this guy. You're welcome. To he's stuck, I think. Lose. Stuck. I'm going to lose him. Yeah, I know. He's going to get lost. Okay, well, uh, uh, I didn't uh, plan to have a friend today. He's going to get lost in the long grass. Maybe I should have given him some, something different than a, than a moss block. But anyway, um, this is fun. Uh, let's get him out of the grass. I, can't, I actually can't see the guy. Where is he? There he is. No, don't go all the way back. Oh my goodness, I thought you were going to go all the way back. Oh my goodness. I'm panicking. I'm panicking a little bit. This is actually wild. Anyway, so I got distracted by Hypno with the pickaxe, and now I've ended up with an LA. That's how Hermitcraft works, I guess. You know, this is actually working. This is actually working. He's actually just picking up my, my junk. This is... Okay, this is actually amazing. When you when you get a good, like, flow going. Uh, this is quite good. Look at him. He's using the roads and everything. What a talented LA. Might need some of those blocks back. In fact, wait, I'm getting him home. I'm actually getting him home. I'm actually getting him home. Wait, how long? How many can they t they hold? Can they hold a stack? Sorry, this is yes. I'm like I'm like what? How many years too late? Three years too late or something? <laughs> On the allies. I'm just hoping I might have to borrow a lead from my uh, my horse, because this guy is somehow more chaotic than a horse. Oh, I don't have. Wait, no way. Wait, wait, wait. I can make one. I can make one. Quick, quick, quick. He's definitely picked it up already and he's probably flying off somewhere. No, you don't fly off somewhere. Wait, where's my... Oh, there he is. There he is. Wait, wait, wait. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Uh, You can go here with my, the horse right now. Okay, anyway. I can now check the absolute mess that I've made below. Which is for some reason giving me frame rate issues as well. <laughs> oh, it's a little bit cobblestone. We can fix that. We can fix that. I was actually planning to uh, gather some moss from it and not bone meal, so... Hypno completely threw me there. Um, I've just been doing some, just, you know, just some of this work. Just some time lapse, you know, just while I'm AFKing my little moss farm, uh, but bone milly farm thing. It's a sign. Got him. Good job, though. Proud of you. What? Does it mean something in here? Like, what is this? What does this mean? Like actually, like, like, like actually, what does it mean? Did you get me? Because, I mean, yeah, I didn't expect that to be there. I was literally zoned out as well. I didn't even notice it. <laughs> For some reason, that was like really hard to see. But uh, it has to go because I'm building. So <laughs> thanks, person. But also, uh, no thanks. I need to remove it. Sorry. I'm building. I'm busy building, okay? Busy, busy stuff I'm doing. <laughs> Right, well, I've got some extra terrain done just because I was in the mood to do that. And, well, I've got some blocks in my inventory, which are the ones that I think I'm just going to do for the platform. I think we're going to keep it very simple and plain because I think most of it's going to be covered or not being able to be seen anyway. So I think, you know, well, let's just go with something basic. I can dig out the floors in different things once I start building on top of here so that they have different flooring. But I think, honestly... Let's just like do a bit of a random assortment and you know what I can refine where these patches of like dark and light are when the buildings are in. Because ultimately part of the reason I was not going to do this was because I was like ah you know I want to add detail and stuff but you know what let's just let's just let's go back to our roots. Let's go back to the the random assortment of blocks that you would just chuck down at any minute without even thinking. Let's just do that. Let's do a bit of that. A little bit of that. And also let's just chuck in some stone bricks as well. You know, and then also, while I'm at it, start getting rid of the scaffold. So, uh, wish me luck and let's hope I have some sort of amount of blocks. I want to try and at least reach there. So, I think that's my first aim to head through this quarter. And then we'll try and fill in the front. So, I've built um, a quarter of it. 
and uh, let me just get a helicopter force in the air real quick to uh, just just really take in the scale of this thing. I may have made a mistake, maybe? Helicopter force going up in the air. The, yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, I'm sure it's fine, right? I'm sure it's fine. Yeah, I should definitely get a wall on here, I think. I think that that would be really good, right? If I get a little wall down here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can see me, right? Uh, not quite. Uh, I'm not really good at lining this up. But yeah, I think it's time that I add a little bit of a wall as well. Because then, basically, we should be able to uh, see a little bit more of the, the, the like, what I'm planning. Also, it looks very dark down here. I've added more torches, but I didn't actually need any more torches. It just is just... It's, it's kind of dark. And scary. Rude. You're deaf and you can't even hear me. <laughs> Name tech. Uh, Joe sells them. They sell, he sells them for one diamond each. In he in his book store. Get out of here. <laughs> ah. No, he's. But get. Get. Okay, so you couldn't even talk to me. Can't even talk to me. Deserves to be whacked with the mop. I don't have my bag on me. Mm. I would have would have hit with a bag otherwise. But anyway, the platform done. This is what it looks like a guest from underneath. Not my plan to look down here, but yeah. surprise red attack just just appears. Uh, yeah. What do we think? What do we think? He didn't say anything, so I. I <laughs> it's just normal at this point. Everyone's just like, yeah, Fox is building a giant circle, right? <laughs> no, funnily enough, I actually plan to build a variety of shaped buildings uh, on this here circle. That is the plan. Uh, and this is just sort of my way to, like, like, look at this. Look at the, look at the, I mean, granted, I'm up a little, a few more blocks, right? But look at the, look at the view. I can see literally the whole town from on this platform. Whereas if I am down here on the ground, I can't see a thing. I can't see a thing down here. So, you know what? I'm pretty happy with this. I mean, yes, it's going to look rubbish for quite a while until I build up even more walls. But uh, you know what? It, look, it looks good so far. So let me just uh, add some walls in the theme of the bridge. That's the plan. So I decided to start off with something fairly simple. The pillars, the main structure of the build, because uh, it needs some sort of support that fits the current design. And as I said a little bit, this is actually going to chop and change because I'm actually going to be taking the law in a different route. But this is subject to change, so don't get, you know, your heart set on it. We'll, we'll see how it goes. But the plan is that this is going to be a little bit of an island that is that of an ancient civilization. That basically left it abandoned for a long, long time. And so no one's been here for years, if not decades, maybe. So the design is going to be a little bit maybe post-apocalyptic, maybe junkyardy, or just plain random. The idea is that a whole new civilization of people have come along and have built it back up again to use it as a place to live. But seeing as though so many years has passed, the style and the maybe even the species of people have changed. Uh, although that is something I haven't really thought too much about yet. But basically my plan is to experiment an absolute bunch this season with detail, different block palettes, and honestly there's no better way than to just keep everything really open right now. So even though you're seeing this bamboo and dark oak blocks quite a lot at the moment with my build, it's not going to be how it fully ends up. But I'm excited about it, and honestly that is all that matters. I get asked an awful lot about what to build, how do I get inspiration, etc. And you know what? Other than doing your own research and opening your mind up to different build styles, etc. The main thing is excitement. That's what's really, really going to drive you. Or at least me this season, hopefully. So uh, I'm excited. And hopefully you guys are too. So come along for the ride and join me this season. For hopefully a pretty fun build. Sorry, Beef. Just using your roof as, you know, the, the, the viewing platform. <laughs> anyway, I decided to just do a very, very basic gradient and actually just live with it for a little bit. And also step back because... I thought about something while I was building, well, I actually did the whole circle pretty much. I think there's a couple I've missed, like that one. <laughs> I've missed that one. I've been lining them up with each other and it, it, for some reason the math hasn't been adding up. So we're going to have to go back and check all those pillars. <laughs> They're not quite in the right spots, but whatever. Anyway, it's fine. Uh, but yeah, I thought, you know what, looking over at that, that's kind of a bit of a darker gradient. And then you know what, what if we just continue on that line roughly? <laughs> 
it down to even lighter. And so I've got bone blocks now. And I, I really, really want to use bone blocks uh, this time around with my build. I don't think it's a, it's a block I've ever used, really, for like walls and stuff. Probably because it's usually quite expensive for me because I don't have a farm for myself. But uh, I do now. What do you think? I'm actually, I think, going to leave it like that. Uh, I don't think I'm going to actually do anything else with it uh, right now because I want to just live with it. I want to just see how it feels and and then maybe I think think about what we're doing up here, which I believe I don't know if I've did I do anything here basically around this sort of block like here, right? We're going to have like a bit of a smaller circle and so you're going to have a path around it. And then that's going to go up maybe like five block, maybe maybe a little bit higher than five. Uh, but yeah, it's going to basically be a, bit, a little bit taller. And, and the plan is to just build lots of different buildings around it a little bit. But seeing as though this is going to take so many resources, actually, I am... Oh, I've, got, I've lost them. I've lost them. I'm speaking of resources and I'm literally losing them. Where are they? Don't go anywhere. I'll have to look for, with F3B. We don't. I can't be losing you. Is that everyone? Oh my goodness, that was a deep cave down there as well. I don't want to lose any of these things. I need them all. I need them all. You've just seen the scale of the build. What I was about to say before I was rudely interrupted by these yoga boxes, which don't want to... They hit. They're too full. They're too full. They're too full. Things go in Go in here, maybe. That'd be, okay, that's not going to work, is it? Dang it. Anyway, basically, <laughs> what I'm trying to say before I'm interrupted by my own blocks is that that's it all the time I have for this episode. That is it. That, that's it. Sorry. Uh, I thought I could get a little bit more done, but to be honest... Ooh, hoo, hoo. I underestimated myself there, I think. So, yeah, uh, that is going to be it for the, today's episode. Leave a like if you do enjoy, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will catch you all in the next episode. See ya!